Ted is 22 years old, goes to the University of San Francisco, an economics major. And he is up against Eric Saunders, 23 years old, from Ashland, Oregon. Eric is somewhat of a dark horse here in the finals because he came through by defeating Bill Rose, the defending champion. It's quite an upset. Whoever wins, stand by. This will be something now. If Ted Pollock should win here and his brother Jim Pollock should win in the medium point, it would be the first time in history that brothers would have won two of the three men's crowns. Here we go. That it started. And he He's got a slight advantage, but Saunders comes back. Get behind it, Jay, that's it. Get behind it, Brady. You got it. Wear him out. That's it. Get behind it. That's it. That's it. He's got it. Ted Pollock wins the World Lightweight Wrist Wrestling Championship. He's embraced by his brother Jim, who has yet to win. This is a big moment in the Pollock family. Ted, congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. I think your brother Jim was as, as pleased as you were. Well, listen, I'm the same way with all of his matches. You know, I've been, I've been watching him win championships for years and years, and I'm sure glad now that I could add one to the family. But right now, I've got to admit that the biggest thing on my mind is, is watching him. You know, he's well, never have a great match too. All right, never before in history have two brothers won two of the three crowns, and now you've got one leg on the triple crown, Ted Pollock. Yes, thank you very much. Thank you very much. And yet to come will be Brother Jim in the medium weight. We'll be back with more from the World Championship Wrist Wrestling Tournament here in Petaluma, California, in just a moment. into the lightweight semifinals and these are 151 pounds up to 175 pounds and the match we're about to see is Ted Pollock against Tim Donovan. Donovan facing the camera here. He's from Highland Park, California. Ted Pollock is from San Francisco and Ted Pollock is the defending champion here in the lightweight division at the World Wrist Wrestling Championship. I think it's interesting to watch the enormous concentration of the competitors here just as the match gets underway. From that point on, it really becomes a matter of just gutting it out. The winner of this one goes on to meet Fred Henson in the lightweight finals. A look at Tim Donovan, now Ted Pollock, Ted's brother Jim, was a perennial champion in the middleweight division, but he was eliminated this year. Pollock is on the right. Got to keep one foot on the floor. He wins. Chad Pollock defeats Tim Donovan and will go into the final against Fred Henson in the lightweight division. You're watching the World Wrist Wrestling Championships from Petaluma, California. More in a moment. Now, boy, good luck to you. Now we move into the lightweight final. 151 pounds up to 175 pounds, and this is Ted Pollock of San Francisco, the defending champion, going against Fred Henson of El Cajon, California. Fred Henson is a horseshoer. Uh, Ted Pollock is in the life insurance business. Ted's brother Jim won the middleweight championship five times here in the World Wrist Wrestling Competition and trains with Ted. Tomorrow on ABC's Wide World of Sports at 4.30 Eastern, 3.30 Central, and 4 Pacific Time, figure skating from Tokyo, the World Professional Figure Skating Championships, and Dave Waddle and Marty LaQuarrie had an outstanding field of runners and a special invitational mile run from Los Angeles. All of this tomorrow over most of these ABC stations. You see how, how much they worry about any kind of a disadvantage at the beginning. Keep one foot on the floor. That's what the official is looking at there. Elbows in there. Elbows. Oh, they're just deadlocked, aren't they? Straight up. Elbows and down. Elbows and down. This is for the lightweight championship. Pollock's got him moving and Pollock wins it. 